All right, welcome to All That and Then Some with Dewana. I am Dewana. If this is your first time here, how are you doing? What I like to do here, I like to tell stories from my past that made me the woman I am today and all that other good stuff because God made me all that and then some, period. But what I am doing today is I'm doing a plus size haul of a new place that I found um, in a little journey I took this past weekend, all right? Now, I want to do a little full disclosure. I, my grandson is in the room. He's watching his tablet, but he might run out here. And I might have to yell at him. But we're going to get through this because I ain't made no videos and I don't know how long because I don't never have the space to myself anymore. And it's not Mason that I'm complaining about. But I love him anyway. So, what, so yesterday with the Ladies of Heat, which is the women, the women ministry at my church, Truth and Transparency Ministries, I put the name up here. I need y'all to go follow them right now. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Subscribe to our TikTok. All that. We need to get to a thousand so we can go live on TikTok. Help us get there. But we went to brunch and we drove about an hour and a half out of where we're located, um, which is in Salisbury, Maryland, and went to this restaurant called Take Your Pick. Okay. Food scrumptious. Like, I ate all of it. All of it. And truthfully, now that I'm thinking back, I wish I had got a doggy bag and ordered something to bring home. You know? Like, I, I really want to... I... Okay, I'm going to tell y'all something I ain't never told nobody before. I ain't never had chicken and waffles. No. I ain't never had chicken and waffles. Why? I don't know. I just... I For some reason, I didn't think I liked sweet stuff on my chicken. But I've been eating sticky chicken. Well, there's only one person sticky chicken that I like. But um, I've, I've, I've tasted sticky chicken. I'm like, oh, my God. Like, sweet stuff on chicken is really good. And I almost tried it yesterday, but I said, no, I really want some French toast. So that's what I ended up getting. But being that it was an hour and a half away, I drove there. So on the way back, I decided to do some sightseeing, you know. And I told y'all how I am, well, I don't know, I, I did a, some shorts and stuff about, I'm trying to go to different thrift stores now that aren't like name brand, like Goodwill, Salvation Army. I'm trying to go to these mom and pop thrift stores and see what they, see what they working with. And I'm telling you what, they are working a whole lot better than those big ones. Okay. Um, so the first place I went to was Halo, Halo Bargain Center. And um, they had like 50% off of coats, jackets, anything, long sleeve, pants. They trying to get rid of their winter collection. And they had a bunch of stuff in there. A bunch of stuff in there. But let's get into the first thing I got. Plot out. Okay. Look at this Converse t-shirt. This Converse t-shirt is a large. And it was in the men's section. You see this? Like how cute is that? And then let's talk about the mermaid skirt. All right. This is the large, too. This whole outfit is a large up in this 1820 body. How? I don't know. I'm just good like that. So, <laughs> but look at it from the back. Like, when I put my Spanx on and, oh, and then oh, I'm in there. Like, I love this. And I'm wearing this to work. So, I'm wearing this to work this week. And taking me a bunch of pictures. Watch. All right, let's see. I only got one more thing from them because I, I had a limit in my head. I'm only spending $40 on this road trip sightseeing thing that I did, okay? So let's see what I got next. All right, next up I have this dress. Um, I feel like this is a very formal dress, but I really bought it because it got the two. Ooh, I feel like my legs are ashy, but they're really not. It's how the light is shining on my legs that make my legs look ashy. So every time I look in this thing, I'm like, are my legs ashy like that? But they're not. I swear to God, they're not. So, because it, it, it looks too, like, semi-formal for me, like, I couldn't wear this, like, to work or to church or something like that, I would probably put, like, a jacket, this jean jacket. This jean jacket, I've had it. I got this from Salvation Army a couple months ago. But it's nice and stretchy, and it goes with the theme of what I'm doing here. But... See how this looks? I love me a lace. I love me a tool. And I'm going to put some tool underneath of this tool. You understand what I'm saying? But let me get a close-up so you can see what it actually 
This is a size 20. I got this from the Halo Bargain place as well. So it's a little big. It's a little size 20 women's. Can I tell y'all something? I used to think, okay, so you know that there's size 18s and then there's size 18W. I didn't know the W stood for women's. You know, I really thought the W stood for 18. And I, I'm I'm a big girl, so I guess I can say it. And I'm not going to hurt nobody's feelings. Because I'll be hurting my own feelings. I thought it meant 18 wide. <laughs> Meaning that it's made wider or something than a regular size 18. I mean, I need somebody to tell me what the difference is between a size 18 and 18 women. You know, because... I buy both, and I feel like they both fit me the same, so, but anyway, but, so this is a size 20 women, so it's a little, which, for it to be loose here, the way my tata sit, I don't like, I feel like it needs to be tighter, it needs to be up here a little bit more, um, this actually does have a zipper, as you can see in the back, but I really bought it for this. You know, I'm going to let y'all know right now. I'm probably going to try to do a bunch of videos today. So, you're going to see this hairstyle in a bunch of videos for the next month of March. But, when I come back, Dewana is cutting her hair again. Because I can't deal with having to do something with my hair on the sides. I just can't deal with it. I'm over it. I'm turning 50 in six months. Wait, it's March already? Five months, I'm turning 50 years old. I don't want to do no extra. You know what I'm saying? I know how to do this up here. I, I'm, I'm going to learn how to cornrow my hair. Then I, ain't nobody going to have to do nothing for me but cut my hair on the sides, and I'm Gucci. But I'm just getting off course. All right, so th these are the only two things I got from the Halo Bargain Center. What I really want to talk about is what I got next. But before I do that... On my little journey, coming back home, I stopped at not one, but two flea markets. And I picked up a couple of things, but I wanted to show you one thing I got from the flea market. I'm not going to try it on. Well, I guess I could try it on with this. I bought this cowboy t-shirt. Why? This cowboy boot t-shirt. You know why I bought it? Because it had, like half of the boots on the back and I just I, I felt that that was dope like I was like okay okay Randy Lee Ashcroft I see what you're doing I believe this is a size extra large so these be looking so big but then when I try it on I'm like Demona you're 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 fat <laughs> Stop thinking that you're like Naomi Campbell. No. You're more like Lizzo. See, here we go. It looks so big on them. It looks so big when I put it on. Um, looked at it. Now, I plan on cutting this to maybe about here. So, you know, I could always do something like, oh, that's cute. That is cute. With my little uh, petticoat underneath of it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is Texas. Hey, ain't no hold down. Oh, so lay your guns down, 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 down. You know. And let me tell you, in that flea market, they had this one section that had nothing but cowboy boots. I'm going to put the clip in here. Watch this. Y'all. Oh my God. Look at this. Oh. I want them. Oh my God, I want them so bad. Don't you see that? The one I was gonna buy some of those. I was, I, I, look, I was, my $40 budget was about to be blown cause I was gonna buy me a pair of those cowboy boots but I could not find nobody in that flea market. 
and they had no tags on them. I knew, I felt like they was real leather or a, a, a really close imitation. So I was going to buy them, but I can't read Mexican. I can't read Spanish. So it didn't have no, I don't know what it said on there was the price, but you saw them. And then I saw this cowboy shirt, cowboy boot, um, t-shirt. I said, oh, I got to have it. And now I just made the outfit I'm going to wear together with it. Let's see what I got next. Okay. What I got next. I'm going to talk about it, but I'm going to put an outfit on. And I'm going to tell you how I felt about that. All right. In fact, I'm going to show you this clip. Watch this. And then I'm going to come in on, in my outfit. Oh, look at me. I'm improvising and potassinizing and switching it up and stuff. Hey, hey. I'll be back. <laughs> All I did was try to pull it off my... Look, oh, my God. Look at... What in the... What in the haberdashery and hemoglobin? <laughs> I swear for God. I swear for God. Oh, my God. Every time I touch it, it's ripping. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Uh, uh, I'm hot. I'm hot. <laughs> Since my, my cowboy shirt, cowboy boot shirt is destroyed... I want to show y'all this picture I got as well. Wait, isn't that cute? Before I show y'all the stuff for my next little stop, um, I don't just pocket chain style with clothes. I do it with everything. I really need to do, uh, let's walk around my apartment and show you how many things I got from a thrift store. Because I swear for God, 75% of the stuff I bought from a thrift store. But you wouldn't even know it. Or I got it for free. Or I got it off the marketplace. Or I got it from somebody's curb. <laughs> but okay, let's get back into the clothes. Oh, yeah. But wait. Are you subscribed? Hmm. Before we go on, I need for y'all to go ahead and hit the subscribe button. I'm still trying to get to my 1,000 followers. I'm at 970-something. So as soon as I hit that 1,000, the 1,000th person... The thousand person I see, if I can see it, because you know sometimes YouTube doesn't tell you like all your people who follow you. Only a random few will pop up saying, "Oh, this got a new subscriber," and give you their name. Um, but if I see your name and you're not, and all of a sudden that's when I see I have a thousand subscribers, I'm reaching out to you. Yeah, be looking out. All right, let's get to the next thing. Uh, I'm just so happy to be able to talk freely with my grandson back there screaming a little bit. And playing, but I'm still getting it done because I got vision for this. Mm -hmm. I went to this store. I had doubts about this store, okay? Never heard of it before in my life. Looked at some of the stuff and I was like, mm, this stuff in here is for old people. Look at that. You see? All right, so let's get into this first dress. This dress is from Ashley Stewart, y'all, okay? And when you looked at my little, uh, my little clip from my TikTok, I was very hesitant. I was walking around there like, oh, this must be a place that, no, let, let me just set the scene real quick. I walked in and the line was like to the door of people at the checkout, right? And I'm like, what is going on? And then boom, I see over there signs that say three, four, five. And I'm like, $3, $4, $5, what? Oh my God, those are like my favorite numbers other than free, but free ain't a number. Did I like to pay for stuff? You know, so then I'm like, is this a thrift store? What kind of store is this? Do they get like an influx of like extra stuff or stuff that didn't sell? I need to know what's going on. Okay. So I walked around there with my camera. I'm looking at stuff. I'm not seeing nothing I like until I get to a rack that said three, four, five. But take another 50% off. Okay. What? Wait, hold, hold up. So you telling me in this store that ain't a thrift store, I don't think, that they're going to give me some, they're going to already have it marked down to either three, four, or five dollars, and then you're taking a 50% off of the lowest price of five dollars? That's what it meant. Okay? So you have to understand, this bag of clothes, I got a whole bag of clothes. I'm going to get it for you. Oh, 
Oh wait, I gotta put other stuff. What do I do with it? Oh, wait, hold on a minute. Now, we're separating what how we do this. So That's how much stuff is in this bag. That's how much stuff is in this bag. All this stuff in this bag, including this dress, the total price of all of this stuff in this bag, including this dress, was $20. Don't believe me? Just watch. Total comes to $20 even. So let's get into the outfit. This Ashley Stewart dress it is a size 22, 24W, so it is a little big on me, but you know what? I ain't mad at it. I'm not mad. I'm not complaining about nothing that I bought from label shoppers, okay? Dewana will be driving another hour again in the near future to go back to that store. I, I'm not playing. I'm, I'm not playing because this Ashley Stewart dress was in there, and what I paid for this Ashley Stewart dress, It is worth, it's worth the gas money. You understand? It's worth the gas money to go back up there. Now, the only thing I don't like, it shows too much of this, so I will definitely have to, you know, button that up, safety pin that on up. But everything else, ooh, and I like it. Let's see what I got next out of that bag, okay? Y'all gonna be surprised, surprise. All right, y'all, y'all, y'all see this dress, like, I'm going to the Poconos this week. This is going in the bag. Just throw it in the bag. Oh, oh, oh. Just throw it in the bag. Oh, oh, oh. It's got the slits on the side, honey. Honey. It is nice and rouge, so it hides all your little bumps and clumps, plus it makes you look like you got a booty when you don't got a booty, but wish you had a booty, but you got the top top, so you are right, um, but look at how it looks up, and I, and truthfully, I thought this would be see-through, but can you see that I have on pink flower panties, right, so I think it's okay, and once again, I ain't complaining about not in everything that's in that bag, that, 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 that paper bag. You understand me? They paper bag in it over there. That's why, that's what label shoppers keep. That's why they got, that's why they can do what they do, what they do. All right, let's see what I got next. Whoo! Yeah. <laughs> I'm All right, back. so I'm giving you a two for one here, okay? This is a Zara top with like, I, I don't know what to do with this, so I just wrapped it around. It took me forever to come take it off. But can we get into this skirt, okay? It feel like velvet. It look like velvet, but a swing. Like it's never a swing before. And, you know, you already know, I'm going to throw a petticoat up underneath for this. And I like how it got like a little band, bandeau kind of um, tie. Can you see that? See how that bandeau kind of tie? And... Just so y'all know, Zara, ain't Zara, ain't she somebody special? This still has the Zara tag on it, y'all, okay? And I'm going to tell y'all how much I paid for it. You see that says? You see what that says? That says $3. So, 50% off the lowest price. $1.50 for this Zara shirt that's never been worn, okay? Then, this was $14.99. I'm just going to tell you how much this whole outfit costs. Because I'm going to show you, you can pocket change style. It don't just got to be from a thrift store. You just got to know how to shop. And, I'm, and then I'm going to do a quick rant. Okay? This was $14.99. So, I was like, yeah. This was on the rack with 50% off the lowest price. But I was like, uh, I don't see no slash in it. I don't see no $5 on here. I don't know. You know, Lord, give me a sign. Hit me, baby. One more time. And I went to the register with it. Because I almost put it back on the rack. But I went to the register with it. And I said, this was on the, um, you know, the, the this was on the rack that said 50% off the lowest price. But this don't have no slash in it. Can you let me know how much it is? That dude said 250 Do you hear me? That dude said 250 Do you want, let, look, let me, I want to show y'all something. This. I was going to do something on this, but 
I gotta knock everything out when I can knock it all out. You see this coat? When I was a young little girl growing up in that all white community, being the only black girl till fifth grade in my school, six, seven, eight, I was the only black girl, another black boy. Guess was in the eighties in high class communities, you know, Teenagers were, if you had money, you could afford gas. I couldn't afford gas. You know, I used to beg my mom for gas. She would try to buy me palmettos. No, mom, I'm not going to school wearing no palmettos. I want gas. Then finally she bought me a gas overall outfit, and I wore it one time, and then I cut it up into shorts. I was already styling back then. Look, look, look at God. But I went to the local boss gobs last week with my mom. Because she was looking for some stuff. And they had all their winter coats on sale. They had this guest coat, which was, and I still, I've, I've worn this three different times. Move, you don't got no clothes on. And get out your nose. Don't get, don't get up there. Don't make me turn this off. Okay. Go back and close the door. Okay. Say hi. Hi. Okay, now bye. Bye. Uh, so you see the price of this, right? $160. You see that guess? And I probably got it just out of nostalgia of the fact that I couldn't afford this when I was younger. So when I saw a $160 guest jacket, I got it for $30. You can pocket change style at the department stores. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I did better at regular stores like this label shopper store that I did at that flea market where the regular price of that cowboy boot t-shirt I bought was $15. Now, mind you, I got it 40% off. But still, I paid more for that shirt that just tore apart just for me pulling it off. Didn't, the one ain't strong. I don't got no type of muscle. Double the breakaway. That must have been for a stripper or something. You know, was that a stripper freaking t-shirt that that man sold me? Because it just tore so easily. This guest jacket. Now, it's a size large, and it fits me like a crop top, but I wasn't going to leave it there for somebody else to get. Let's get to the next outfit out of the trash bag. Not that paper bag. I'll be back. All right, here is the next sweater. I didn't feel like taking this skirt off, but this is a cute little monochromatic look, you know. Um, I know it's about to turn. It's getting spring. It's spring again. Everybody knows it's spring again. To the girls and boys and people above. But look at this sweater. Like, is this not the cutest thing? Y'all already know I love a fringe. Y'all already know I love. Look at that. Rolling. Rolling. But I love this. And look, again, the tag is still in this shirt. A whole paper bag, $20. Let's see what I got next. I bought, I bought a bunch of shirts. I'm going to be honest with y'all. All right, next up, I got this maxi dress. Now, the only thing about this maxi dress is very, very, very see-through. Like, I feel like I put on some leggings underneath of it, and I don't have to put something on to wear this, like, for real out. I give me one of those really long slips. And I need to find one of those really long slips. Where would I get one of those really long slips? Hello, my Shapapa girls. I know y'all know out there, so leave it in the comments. Leave me a link in the comments where I can get a really long black or even white slip, but I preferably black. So, and I like how this is a size 3X, and the regular price of this, they had it as, I don't know, but it was on sale. But let's talk about this shirt. This shirt, I love this shirt. This shirt is a large, now, I need my good bro on so my boobs don't be, you know. But once I got my good bro on, I just like, I like stuff that shines. Like, in metallic, maybe want to do the shimmy. Like, mmm, yeah, uh-huh, okay, okay, okay. Um, 
So this is by Charter Club. I don't know who Charter Club is, but the price they had on this shirt, it says our price, $44.99. That got to be a typo. Well, no way they were charging $44.99 for this shirt. And then had the nerve to have it on sale for $5 with 50% off of that. Like... I can change styles with the water. I don't know. The Lord be sending me to these places knowing I have an addiction. But I feel like he be, he be guiding me to these places. It ain't my fault. All right. So I got one more thing. And then I'm done. This has probably been a long video. But I ain't talked to y'all in a minute. And I miss y'all. Don't miss me. Get the right, last up. We have this glittered vest. Okay. With the back. What do they call these type of shirts? Like sweater vests is what I feel. This is like a sweater vest type, but I don't got the buttons on top. But the glitter, you know, the sparkle, the sparkly spark, that makes up for not having that. And let me get up close. Like, you see how that? But what I love about it is the built-in shoulder pads. Like, give me your shoulder pad. I'll take me a shoulder pad for 500 Alex. R.I.P. You understand what I'm saying? Like, look at this. And I'm going to show y'all. What's that say? What does that say? Size medium. And I bought it. Because once I knew stuff was half off, I'm like, oh, if I just wear it once, take me a couple good pictures in it. You know, I like my outfit. I'm good if it falls apart. You know, but it don't fit bad for it to be a medium. Like, you know, us big girls now, we, we wear the short stuff now. And, you know, it don't even look bad with this. this, this, this I, I'm still matchy-matchy. I, I, I planned that whole thing. I, mind you, I'm just pulling stuff off the bag. I'm like, okay, now I'm going to do this. Come on. You know what? I got the vision, Lord. I got the vision. I would just listen to church today. You got the vision don't mean... Miss Akia, she preached that thing. She preached that thing. You understand me? Vision don't mean something that you see now. Vision is something that you know is going to happen. It's going to pass. You believe it. You envisioned it in the future. I see the vision, Lord. I'm going to keep working at it. But that's all I got for y'all today. I want to get up close and personal and say thank you for all my new followers. I went from having 920 something to 970 in less than a week. And I'm really excited about that. I'm, I'm really excited about getting to a thousand followers. I'm really excited about keep on teaching and testifying uh, about God's love um, and mixing that in with my love of fashion and style and all things, um, all that and then some with the world. Um, so do me a favor. If you have not yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Uh, share it with your friends, your mama, your papa, your sister, your brother. I don't care who you share it with. Just share it with somebody. And leave me some comments. Help me get to my thousand followers. For all my Shapapa girls out there and my Shapapa dudes, until next time, remember, God made you all that and then some, okay? And don't you ever forget it. All right? Bye! Whoop. Mm -hmm.